it's recording. <laughs> Hi, third graders. Hi, third grade. So we've been in the classroom today prepping your go home bags, and today we're going to show you everything that's inside of them. We are very excited to start our online learning. For now, you can just relax and enjoy your spring break. Hopefully, you're having some time with your families and your pets and being home and outside. But we wanted to give you a little sneak preview of some of the things that we'll get up to after break. Um, so one of the first things you have is a plastic bag for Marianne for some fun art projects. We also have a brown paper bag that includes some of our U of I art materials. So for right now, you can look through things, but please hold off on actually using them because we'll need them for each of our projects as we learn about Picasso and Matisse and tons of other artists. Um, you've got some paper plates for a fun fractions game. And uh, also every single third grader has a copy of the BFG. We might start reading this in a couple weeks together as a class and have some book clubs to discuss it. Along those lines, you'll also find several of the books that were in your book bin so that you can enjoy reading at home. And just be careful to keep these somewhere safe so that eventually they can come back to school. And if you have Mac Boulder library books in your book bag, you can actually come to school and drop those off in a bin. And Dars is gonna email you about that. And that way, if you need to be checking out new books from the Mac Boulder library, you can. Alrighty. You might find some stray papers or paper airplanes in this case. We cleared out your mailboxes, so those will be paper clipped. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're going to find your um, conference script sheet and all of your mailbox stuff along with some notebook paper inside. We also have our handy dandy cursive handwriting notebooks. We gave you also your very own whiteboard marker and eraser uh, to use for showing your work. We also have a few more art supplies. We have watercolor paper, and every student also has a set of watercolor paints. So we will use these for projects. So again, try not to use them beforehand, um, but there's plenty of watercolor paper for all of our projects. Um, the last things you have are your math workbook from whichever math class you're in, your writing notebook and folder. Uh, one thing you could work on is in a week, the deadline for the poetry contest is coming up, actually two weeks. So you could, if you wanted, start looking through your poems and revising or writing some new poems and choosing which one you want to submit. But we will need these for some other writing lessons later. And maybe our grammar book too. And last but not least, you've got some extra school supplies, pencils, post-it notes, a note from Emily and I, and recorder karate books in case you want to perfect your recorder skills. So over break, third graders, you could be reading your Just Write books. You could work in your cursive notebook. You could work on your recorder. Um, you could just have fun playing outside and being creative. You could do a phone call with some of your friends. All these would be great ideas before we start distance learning after break. We are very excited to see you and chat with you either tomorrow or Friday for your conferences. And we miss all of you and can't wait to catch up. Bye third grade. Bye.